All right. Greetings, gamers. This is Jared Lee. Hey, there's my opponent. Uh, another game of Ashes Reborn versus Asterix. We're doing Phoenix League here. Uh, Asterix and I just played in the AIL League. Um, and now we're doing a, we're stepping back a little bit more for fun. It's still a ranked game, uh, but there's no tournament involved in this one. Uh, he just got off work. Um, he's halfway across the the world, and uh, he's kind enough to sit down and play us in Ashes. So I want to thank you, say thank you up front, real quick, to Plaid Hat for making Ashes Reborn the card game. Uh, also, the folks behind Ash Techie, allowing us to play Ashes online with each other, even with folks all the way across the globe. Uh, for if you want to take a look at the decks, I'll have, I'll have mine posted within the, on YouTube. But I'll also try and put the link that'll take you to Ashes.Live, where we make our decks. And there we go. Uh, you can also check out my website, Proxism by Design. Uh, let's see now. Ooh, Grimton. This is gonna be weird. Um, okay, he can have stuff. Was I thinking shared sorrow? But I can't do that. Uh for and then finally, if you're into ashes, wanna check this out, if you just kind of stumble into this um a video then uh checks out come on discord uh it's uh ashes community discord we're a friendly bunch uh got about i'd say about a hundred people uh active on daily uh, you can usually find games okay yeah check us out so let me count my dice here uh trying out the mono dice thing one two three four Five, six, seven. I want something that costs two. He could be doing. Huh? He wouldn't, but he could be. But I doubt it. He's not doing creeper, is he? <laughs> we're just trying. I've never played this deck before, so we're trying a bunch of different stuff. I really want to do transmute to make sure that I get the Phoenix Barrage off. Um, spellboard four. You know what I should do? I should run magic siphon in this deck. Uh, let's go. Shared sorrow, I guess. No, that doesn't make sense. We're gonna go Shatter Pulse. Probably a mistake. Ah! All right, let's let's go. All right, good luck and have fun. Awesome. Oh, he could be doing Realm of the Absurd. He is doing a version with Celestial Knight. Holy Shatter Pulse, Batman. Oh, that is so fun. Okay. One great thing about doing mono dice, you don't have to meditate very often, so it leaves your sides open, which is great. Um. So we're going to opt for Shatter Pulse over Phoenix Barrage, probably. Maybe we'll play both, but I doubt it. Ooh, I have so little life. <laughs> if he's running the burn package on top of it, this could be a very short game. You know what? Let's just get him out there. Okay. What if he's like just slams the knight into me again? That'd be awful. Uh, 
right on it. I love to see lots of different colored dice. For a long time, people said, oh, with Holy Knights. For a long time, uh, Holy Knight would be better in this situation. Not going to lie. Uh, but for the most part, you're going to want Celestial Knight. For sure. Ooh, reinforce. That's what we like to see. I really like that reinforce. Uh, for a long time, people just play the two to three colors. And I feel hopefully I was part of the idea that you could run a lot more colors. Like, you can run seven co colors if you want to. Mm, sure. I can see running both, depending on the matchup. Ooh, Lightbringer. Okay. Well. Okay, let's get... Get cricket out there. Hmm. Very possible. Uh. Very good. Well. <laughs> well. <laughs> not our. Not our one. <laughs> Just uh, as a first five flex. <laughs> mm. Oh, shoot. Yeah, there there was a good reason to do that. <laughs> okay. Oh, let's attack the Lightbringer. We'll see what happens here. Could just have some Bali, yeah. Dang it, yeah. Just putting the spirit out there was the right call. Yeah, I'm in trouble already. Okay, should we meditate once? So then that way, when night when cricket dies, I can just grab sympathy pain. All right, triggers reinforce. Grabs Shepherd. Ugh. So even when I gag the Celestial Knight. Oh, so grab the shepherd, just meditated it. Okay, right on. Okay, so I think what we do here... But if I do this, I won't be able to play Ancestor Spirit and use Lulu. Hmm.
which might be okay. I'll get three in. You know what? Just attack. No, nah, just play Ancestor. What are we pinging? The spirit? Hmm, butterfly monk. Okay. Well, let's get in there. Well, we can. Hmm, there's purify. Not so great against my. Not really, anyway. All right, let's go ahead and Phoenix Barrage. Uh, yeah, that worked out pretty well. I'm gonna take a look at Spark. To do damage to a target unit, so I can shoot my own monks if I need to. Okay, I'm going first now, so Beast Mage is less great. I do have a shared sorrow to flip down the Beast Mage, so I can play two barrages this turn. I did get another. Okay, things are looking up here. So let's go get them. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, you don't have much room for anything else, but that's okay. Just attacking for two. And yeah, you don't get all this excitement anymore because he's exhausted, but that's okay. How much do you really need, right? Hmm. I wonder if Shepard was his other card in the end. Yeah, so the deck is a little bit of spin down, a little bit of burn, a little bit of bypass. Like it's just got a little bit of everything. Um too little life at 16. <laughs> so that's the problem with this type of deck is that it's not focused enough. Uh, right now, like it looks good, right? That first five of Shatter Pulse was a high five for me, but that's something you, that you'd want to do versus Sambali, right? All right. We're going to play another Magic Siphon. Okay. So he's playing a little bit of that game too. Uh, should we get an Ancestor Spirit? Seems right. So then we can flip down Anchor Nut. 
Boy, I don't know what else you really want, though. Anchornut's pretty good. I don't think you need another night song cricket. I drew into what I needed. Hmm. How about I do this? We're going to bolster using that to get another two damage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, triggers reinforce, which is a main action. Let's see what you get. Ideal, you're digging for another Shepherd of Lost Souls, so you can slam it down to flip the Celestial Knight back into hand. Frostfang? Okay. Frostfang's good. How about we play Phoenix Barrage? Mm. Okay, well, we know he doesn't have a... Oh, yeah, I don't need a side action here. You know, no, he doesn't have a fate reflection, so that's good. One, two, three, four, five. I have six dice left. I really want to use five of them to Shared Sorrow back into Phoenix Barrage. I mean, I can also just, like, there's nothing wrong with just playing the field, right? So one, two, three, four, five, six. They could also do it that way. Oh. Okay. Mm. Uh, a realm walker would be amazing if you played it right now. Well, she's got the dice for it. Yeah, attack for two. It's a very aggressive deck. Uh, I like that. We're just kind of beating the crap out of each other here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so I can get to the Salamander Monk. Ooh, or we'll just anchor on it. No, I think a Salamander Monk is probably the way to go.
I'm really hoping he plays Brill <laughs> Walker. <laughs> Passes their main action. One, two, three, four, five, five dice. You just attack the Lightbringer. Battlefield of six. Just play a book. I'm just kind of put it back into their court. There's a free main action, right? See if Asterix changes their mind about what they want to do. Yeah, so this is all part of just checking out the Mono Dice series. I, I've seen Mono Sympathy decks before, so it's not like I'm entering new ground here. Okay, uses that to spin down. All right. Okay. Okay. Mm hmm. Ding. Good old anchor nut. Hmm. I want to meditate. Maybe. Um, I mean, we don't have any reactions in the hand, so I don't need to, right? Don't really need a second night cricket book. I'd love to see what's in his hand. Okay, polarity mage makes sense. Okay, so now we're down to. You just play some dudes, right? Good night. Song cricket, or do you attack here? Make you attack here. Oh, there's the guard. Okay. I think I play Beast Mage. Beast Mage, Ancestor. Monk goes away at the end of the round, frees it up. The one thing the deck does have is just a ton of removal. It has a lot. Shared Sorrow. River Scalds. Crescendos. There's your Wave Crash and Crescendo. There's your Bypass. A little bit of Cheeky Transmuter. That's part of the spin down. More removal. More removal. Burn, burn. Removal. String Mage, just in case. Can't go wrong with the times one. 
string mage, I don't think, these days. All right, goes for the pass. All right, I'm going to meditate. Choose the top. There's Crescendo. Meditating, we'll do Ancestor Spirit. Do you wish to draw a card? No. No, that's okay. Get the light bringer. Rarity mage. Boy, I don't know what happens here. My worry is an adept duelist. But that's part of like the brain games that happen, right? Like my brain is like, well, it could be all sorts of stuff. I don't know. I mean, if it is, like, I would have board. I still have the board. Night Cricket. Uh, Beast Mage. Okay. See what happens here. I'm going to have to draw another three cost card, which makes me a little nervous. How many more three cost cards do I have in the deck? One. Two, three. No, one of them's, yeah, really just two. I don't know if that was the wisest move there if I was trying on to stick with burn, but. Oh, fiddlesticks. Okay, well. Let's get them while you can. You're going away anyway. That's funny. Clear the board or do damage? I feel like do damage, right? Okay. No. Oh, what the transmute. And the sympathy pains. All right, so I've got four. I need to draw for that third card so I can get to six. But let's see what uh, what he puts out here first. I can get two through, but I doubt it. Well, no, I can. I'll get two through for sure. You can bolster. All right, so he does that. Okay. 
This is going to be close. What if you do that? What if you Phoenix Barrage now? Transmute, magic, spin down, that. Spin that down. Phoenix Barrage. And then get in for four. And then you just sit. Okay, that's how you do it. You do that right now. Okay. Choose up to nine dice. Wait, read this. Okay, swap any number of dice in your exhausted pool. Okay. Change one of your dice. Okay. Change one of your opponents. Okay. Then Phoenix Barrage. Done. We'll go Butterfly Monk. Lightbringer. There. Okay, nature's wrath, pass. Yeah. Maybe I got a little greedy. <laughs> I mean, it's no. Polyphony. Sure, which one's that? Okay, let's spin down that one. Mm. Can I fade away? No. Hmm. Pops that back up. Shared sorrow for his river skull is interesting. Scar the string mage. Oh, draw? Yeah. Oh, second sympathy. We'll put the transmute down. Yep. Chance we'll give him the player image back. Yeah, you have to figure out a way to do more put some more draw on this deck. Uh, I have not been a huge fan of uh oh, what is it? Second I wanna say second sight, but that's not right. What's the action? Of new ideas. And it's not that it's a terrible card. I just don't feel like you're getting the best out of it. But I am running kind of a combo deck, right? So it seems like it would be all right.
Yeah, let's just go get him. I'm sure to attack the face. I mean, there, there's a possible world where he doesn't guard, but, you know. Okay, what am I doing now? Pass him. Seer. Seems good. Root armor. It's got the alert. Okay. Alright, so we can now have to rely on. Yeah. We're now going to rely on the burn part of the deck. Which works just fine. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Should we draw? Ooh. We're keeping that. Does that burn? Reinforce. What's he gonna grab here? On the seven leg. Grabs a Celestial Knight that he can play. Okay. Oof. Not a great sound. Hmm. Let's get rid of Celestial Knight or Frostfang. Let's go. Now that it's focused, I can start getting rid of cards out of his deck. Holding on to this one die for a sympathy pain. Hmm. Yeah, Salamander monks to the rescue. Am I right? Yeah, he should. He should attack that monk. This guy. Yeah. Gets rid of the. Gets rid of the reinforce, huh? It's really worried about that, huh? Shame. Huh. All right, there's Celestial Knight. We got some armored up peeps. Now we just take a beat into the face, is what we do. He gags these two guys. <laughs> mm. 
Mm. Guard. Be close. <laughs> I mean, we can attack there, but. Mm. Yeah, he could win the game if he gets a lion. Lion or frog on his turn. I should not have. Ooh, discarding cards, yes. Oh, come on. How did I not get? Well, fiddlesticks. He did get a frog, so we can find one of them. Okay. Okay. Okay, I get to meditate. Thank goodness, am I right? We... Shared sorrow. Discard the Beast Mage for Phoenix Barrage. And we'll do the three there. Then we meditate. Top of deck for here. We can kill the knight unless he's got uh, root armor or social armor that he can put on right now. Play River Skull. Mm, we're getting down there. This is exciting. Mm, okay. So, shared sorrow for to get the Phoenix Brash back to put two on the Celestial Knight. Battle Seer, Symbali. Butterfly Monk. Yeah, we were afraid of the root armor. However, we can play Phoenix Barrage now.
Right, it's doubled up. I should have hit the Battle Seer both times. That was my bad. Side action. Put a thing on here. Do I, do I need to side action anything? I don't, I don't think I do. Draw a card. That's interesting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think that was it. I think that's game. Oh, not Nature's Wrath. Survival of the fittest? Yeah, you can have survival. Uh, well, it doesn't really matter. I do like how he's out of frogs. That's good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he knows he can get that. The salamander monk to the rescue. No, he gave me anchor net. He gave me a body, which was a mistake. Monk. Ooh. Nice. Didn't even see that one coming. That's on my that's my bad. Meteor to the face. Lightbringer for the win. Good game. Um Is there any way because he's got one left? That should do it. Well played. It was so close. <laughs> oh, that was a great game. There uh, wasn't anything that I could play out there to get that last bit of damage in there before he swung in. Because he knew he had to do four. Um, yeah. Even then, it was great. Yeah, those are very interesting things. It's not a fun playing with that one to kind of check it out. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. <laughs> oh, boy. Well... Uh, yeah, that was a lot of fun. That was great. Things that we'll take a look at the deck. Don't know if I need so many crickets. The low life is a problem. Um, instead of grabbing back, uh, so there, the way that you, the timing works in this, pardon me. So I could have, uh, instead of grabbing Phoenix Brush, I could have grabbed another Shatter Falls. No, he had enough dice left over to do stuff. 
uh, to be able to attack twice too, that it, it wouldn't have mattered. But uh, it's it's a fascinating idea. I'm glad I played it, uh, especially in the Fourth Phoenix League. So thanks everyone for watching. You guys have a great day. Bye bye.